Hello. So I wanted to make this very quick tutorial on plotting data points in Tableau. So I had made this a little while ago, and there's some filters here on the right-hand side, and people have just been asking me how I would, how they would quickly do that in Tableau. So I made a video previously on how to do it in Excel, um, which you can check out, but here's the Tableau version. Okay. So first thing I'm going to connect to my data source. So I have a Tableau demo file here. And obviously it goes without saying, but you need an X and a Y value for where the data happened. And some sort of information about the data is great. Go, miss, point, save in this case. So this is just some, some random soccer data that I have. Okay, so I'm going to go to the sheet. And I want to drag the X to the columns tab here and the Y to the rows tab. And it aggregates the data. So I'm going to go analysis and just uncheck that. So now it has plotted the data, um, not quite as we'd like just yet, but it has plotted the data, so that's great. Uh, let's add in a background image. So browse, I have a soccer pitch here. And it's important to know what the coordinates of the data are or the pitch, the pitch is. So um, I know that this data was collected, there's 100 zones long by 100 zones wide. So left to right is 100 and bottom here is zero with the top being 100. Okay, click OK, OK, it's great. So now we have the data points plotted on the pitch. We want to just tidy this up so a coach or an analyst can see a full size pitch. So edit axes and we want to make a fix. So it starts at zero and ends at 100. And we'll do the same for this one just to make sure because Tableau just automatically sizes the axes, which in this case we don't want to do because we're looking at a map. Okay, perfect. Now let's tidy this up. So let's remove the header. We don't need to see that. It's important in this case. So it's looking much better now. The next thing is we want to add some context to this. So what we don't know whether these are attempts or goals or saves or, or what they are. So event type, we can drag onto color. So now they're colored. Let's use the filled in circles here and the size will increase just a touch. Okay, looking much better. So now what happens is when I click on any of these points, it changes to what I require. Okay. The next thing is when I hover over the data, I'd like it to give me some more information. So rather than just telling me the attempt and, and where on the pitch it happened, I'd like to know what player was involved and what body part they used. So you see now when I go back to my data point, it tells me exactly this was a goal with the right foot by a player in this case. So that's looking pretty good. I'm going to add in some quick filters for these. Okay, so these are my filters. So again, I can say I just want to look at right foot or I just want to look at headers. I can do all that here. Okay, but really what you want to do is go on and make a dashboard of this where you can make it a little bit more interactive and look a little bit nicer. So we drag the sheet in. It adds in our quick filters here, which is great. Uh, so let's tidy this up. So the player one is a list, so it works fine if you've only a few players. But if you had an entire squad or maybe an entire league, this would probably work better as a drop down. So we can change that. And this one here, let's make this a single select. So now I want to know headers by this player. Uh, and is only look at his goals, or only look at his misses. Okay, so you can start to filter out all the data, or certainly a coach can start to filter out all the data. And that's how you plot X, Y coordinates on a pitch in Tableau and add in all the filters that you require. Hope that was helpful.